Yeah, so I'm here with Vanda May, and uh, we've been working on papers, a lot of paperwork, <laughs> lots oh of God. paperwork, because we need to protect our songs on uh, SPA and all these places. And uh, was how was long. your day? It was long. It was long, yeah. This was very. This was this. This is what I'm not. Okay. It was. A so I have, I have, I have this beat that we're gonna do together. Oh, for the for my new album, it's called Future. I'm gonna rap. She's gonna sing. abandoned me to go live in, 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 in London. How do you do with this fucking cold that you have there? I know, it's so cold. It's so, so cold. But the good thing is that it's only cold outside, so really. You don't really spend too much time outside if you think about it. So I'm every... sorry, London is so huge. Like, but you travel from one place in the city to another, you need a day. No, but most, most of the time you're inside and every time you're indoors, it's very hot, always hot. Uh -huh. So that's, you're, never, you're never really, really cold. And how did you get the Cockney accent? What happened? I don't have a Cockney accent. You have a fucking Cockney accent. I do not. <laughs> oh, fuck. Listen, my accent is still Portuguese. No, your accent is far from Portuguese. You speak like a real Londonish girl. This is a great place yeah, to Yeah, I like that. Like I like it. I'm yeah. so hot in here. Gosh. Ooh. I feel like, no, sorry. <laughs> yeah, but as I was saying, you're not really yeah. cold in London, it's, it's all good. Well, we're talking about your accent. Oh, my accent. Mm, yeah, well, that's a good thing. I don't know. What should I say? It's my accent. I'm... No, you really have your... your, your I've, been, I've, been, I've been hearing the change. And actually, it happened very fast. After like six months, you already had the accent. Really? Yeah, but maybe you don't you don't realize because you're talking to people there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who talk it that way? Hey, mate. Yeah. And then hey, you mate. Start, <laughs> you start hey, mating people. No, I don't say hey, mate. Nah, that's no. No, but nah. you say gosh. Yeah, we'll just. Yeah. You say yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Mm. It's okay. You know. and, uh, what can that's I say? I live there. there. I live there. Yeah, it's live it's been three years now. So. So do you like in in in? After after three years, any regrets? No, no. Why did you leave Portugal? Oh, I was tired of you. Oh, you didn't live here. Uh, yeah, <laughs> oh, sorry. Uh, when I arrived, I was like, what that? <laughs> I don't know. I I felt like I needed I needed to change in my life, and I I feel like it's great if you if you like different cultures and everything, and it's it's great because if you go to London, really, you know, there's pretty much yeah, everything. Ev everything, you know, and. Um, and it's an open, uh, open, open world for opportunities as well. So, didn't you like? Uh, don't you feel like it, it, it hurt or not hurt? Did you change your music career? Oh yeah, a lot. Because like you were starting to have some, yeah, some did, momentum in Portugal. Yeah, definitely. I, I know, I know, I know. Professionally, what professionally wise, it was terrible. It was I shouldn't have done it. Well, uh, but but I, I felt you. like yeah I felt like I needed to I needed to change I needed to I needed to meet new people and I, I needed I needed to something different in my life yeah, and me, I couldn't really figure out what it, what it was here in Portugal. So. Me even if people never realize I stopped two times or well, three times actually in my music in my music career I had like hiatus two times uh, two times I would say that I stopped like for two three big years after the second album. And uh, 
when you came to Portugal as well. So, yeah, when I came to Portugal. Yeah. Well, I was releasing tracks. No? I would say when I came to Portugal, I was more changing the, 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 my business views. But I would say the real moment where I really changed my whole... Uh, I stopped for three years. Actually, it was beneficial because when I came back, I came back Show. differently, stronger, yeah. with uh, business sense and stuff. So sometimes I wouldn't say that it's, it's a bad thing to step away and to organize your life because sometimes you can then now like now you look you, you've been releasing tracks after tracks after tracks and actually that last one hello whew, it's really creating something and it's i can see that that uh, it's pulling it's pulling up the rest of the, the of your songs and the fact that you have a lot of songs that we've been working together for five years now yeah. we've been talking forever fuck we've been talking since i5 myspace i know fiddler <laughs> Viddler is way before YouTube, so yeah, it's yeah, like yeah, yeah, long. Yeah. It's been what I think ten years, almost ten years right. now. Yeah. Almost. Yeah, 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 yeah. When almost I came to perform years. somewhere, we met. Yeah, right. yeah, almost ten years. I remember. Wow. So what what do you have for last question? Because uh, she's she's tired. She's hungry. Oh, yeah, I'm hungry. What do you have planned for your fans? the people who, who love your voice uh, because you, you've been doing new songs you have like uh, five or six songs and that like solo I mean, that we did after the album after the album but yeah. then the last three months we didn't hear from you not three months. I hear I hear from her because we <laughs> talk with friends but the there fan, hasn't yeah, been no yeah. new songs it's been three months well that's mm -hmm. why I give that beat to the other girl all right <laughs> Trying to start some beef right here with me. <laughs> I don't like I don't like the personality of you of yours today. No, honestly, um, yeah. I, it's like I told you, it's it's hard for me because with my life, there's very very hard to try and conjugate both music. And Do you hear her accent? Go on, go. On. Um, my accent is fine. Is. Listen, you know, in London, it's it's funny because when I go to London. They People, say you have a Portuguese accent. No, they say I have an American accent. Oh, not at all. When I, when I go to when I go to, to when I go to the States, they say I have a, a British accent. Yeah, you do. And then when I but then I asked all my British friends, I said people people in Portugal say I have a British accent. They they go like, no, you have more of an American accent. I don't know, people. Just decide yourself. I think you're a bastard. I have a Van der Mey yeah. accent. That's you what have I'm a saying. bastard accent. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, so what do you have planned? Now? Planned. Uh, so um, you were supposed to record three months for me, three songs for me. Three songs. Yeah, I've done two. No. No, no, no. Yeah. Three new ones. Oh, three new mm, new ones. Well, uh, I am going to as soon as I go back to London. Actually, I plan on staying like three days. You know, just inside of my bedroom or whatever, just brainstorming new lyrics and melodies. And, and what about your fitness YouTube channel? Oh, yeah, that. Now she's in the fitness life. Oh, yeah. Now you that, don't know. Like, go to her Instagram, she's posting her abs, she's posting naked photos, she has like buff pussy. Like. <laughs> what? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Um, yeah, but fitness is definitely a part of. Big, big part of my life now is becoming bigger and bigger and bigger. Great. Um, I, I was actually thinking about competing for fitness model this this year. Wow, nice. Um, uh, in Bikini Girl as well. Uh, however, once again, I feel like we have to prioritize things, and there there are things, there are moments in life for everything. And at the moment, I don't feel that I'm mentally prepared for for a competition. So uh, I've decided not to do it yet. But I do want to do it, and it's something that I want to pursue as fitness. Is, it has become one of my big passions as well in life as well. Yeah. I go gym pretty much every day, as you can tell. 